It's knowing that you could have been somewhere and then just watching it go by. When I was training for the Olympic Marathon Qualifier, I was out for a typical training run and I was actually up on the sidewalk during the run because I was going to take a right-hand turn pretty quickly, so I figured just staying on the sidewalk would be fine. And a uh, car actually came up onto the sidewalk and hit me. Um, I flipped up onto the car. The person slammed on their brakes, obviously, and it propelled me forward onto the pavement, which um, actually cracked my skull open like an egg. And I severed the two main arteries that supply oxygen to your brain. When this happens, you have about an hour to live. So it was just catastrophic. The first time the physical therapist got me from the hospital bed, we were gonna walk down the stairs and uh, then walk up the stairs and I couldn't even get down the hallway. <laughs> so it was really frustrating and really disappointing to be at such a high place athletically uh, training for something so big as an Olympic marathon qualifier and not even be able to walk 50 yards down a hospital hallway. It's very frustrating to know you were somewhere and keep climbing that mountain every day to try and get back to where you were. And I think all of us as humans realize that sometimes we can't accomplish something but we keep trying at it anyway and it's kind of that drive I think that keeps me going 